happy home groomers it's Mal here and it's the beautiful little fin the cavoodle and in today's grooming session we are going to trim his his little fringe as well as in front of his eyes in today's grooming session the equipment we're going to use today is we're going to use a pair of seven inch straight scissors a pair of seven inch thinning scissors and these two scissors are made by Artero. We are going to use a coat conditioning spray, the Relax, this is his favourite. And we have a metal comb, this has a fine tooth on one end and a medium tooth on the other end. We will mostly use a fine tooth today. And we have our Artero Flexi Slicker. So of course it flexes each side and it has a firm and a soft side. We will mostly use a firm side today, especially around those eyes. The first step we are going to do is we're going to make sure he's got no tangles in his face or any little bits of food around his little muzzle. So we're going to spray from the top a little bit of coat conditioning spray. We will never spray directly into his face. And then we're going to pick up our slicker and gently slicker around his little muzzle. Just doing short little bits at a time, separating all that coat. And pick up our comb and remember we're using the fine tooth side and just brushing all his hair away, making sure there's no little knots or little snarls in his, in his coat. Before we start trimming around Finn's eyes, we just need to get him used to the scissors and the tools that we're going to be used. If you don't feel confident enough to use the scissors around your dog's face, please seek the advice of a groomer. Um, they'll be more than happy to help you. Okay, so we are going to get our comb and brush out those little hairs in front of his eyes. And then we're going to get our thinning scissors and we're going to only use the tip of our thinning scissors. So only about a third, the first third. And then we're going to come up in front of his eye and just gently use our thinners and cut the hair in front. Okay, so now we've got as much hair as we can out of this eye. We are actually going to go to his left eye now and repeat the same process. So just gently scissoring in front of his eye. And we're going up against the grain, against the way his coat grows. And we're just blending into the two sides that we've trimmed already in front of his eyes. So then it's a nice transitional blend. And it looks quite natural, it doesn't look like it's been cut. As a professional groomer, what I see a lot of is people trimming their dog's fringe at home. But what they're doing is they're actually brushing all this hair back and then they're getting their straights and just cutting across. But what we actually want to do, we want our fringe to give our dog expression and frame his face. So I'm going to teach you the correct way in how to trim your dog's fringe. So we are just going to take a section at a time and we're just going to brush that forward. He's slipping off, he's so relaxed. Just a little bit forward at a time. And then we're going to put our scissors, and you might be able to see from this angle a bit better, on a 45 degree angle, and we're going to cut his fringe. And normally you would be in front of your dog, but I have to do it behind so you guys can all see. And we cut towards a corner of our dog's eye. And then a little bit more. And his fringe was actually cut by his owner, so we actually had to fix his little fringe for him. And then again, just taking off the tips. So 
so it frames his little face. And then we are just going to brush away all that hair that we've just cut. And how do you feel, buddy? I hope you enjoyed our little video on trimming fringes. And if you guys have any questions, please pop them in the comments below and we can get back to you. But in the meantime, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Um, until next time, happy grooming. Thank you.